Well, trash everywhere. It appears that students are not making the grade when it comes to moving out at Temple University. Neighbors are complaining about a big mess near their homes. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Payute when digging for answers in this messy situation. It's heartbreaking. It's disgusting. It really truly is. You can see it on just about every corner, every street. Piles of trash more prominent than the pavement. It's really dirty out here. We try to keep it clean, but it's a problem. It's been a problem for years. Residents in North Philadelphia say they've been complaining about this eyesore to no avail. But around this time of the year, they say things go from bad to worse as Temple students move in and out of their off campus apartments. They supposed to have put dumpsters out here in certain areas so when the students move out they can put their trash in there. Do you see a dumpster? Do you see a dumpster? Well not on this street. Eyewitness News captured large red dumpsters placed by the university on Diamond Street and Norris just to name a few. In a statement the university says it is disappointed some students choose not to use the dumpsters but this is not reflective of the student community. I'm pretty glad it's out here. There's definitely a trash problem around here um, just in terms of like students kind of throwing their stuff out when whenever they're moving out. But Kim Jackson Brooks says these are not cutting it. Drive around in the neighborhoods you see mattresses and couch. The trash was Monday. Do you see that right there? So that means that has to sit there till next week. She wants property owners and renters to be accountable for the actions that turned her neighborhood into a dumping ground. I've said it to more than one student on more than one occasion. Treat our neighborhood like you treat where you live at. They don't care. Their attitude is this is North Philly. So what does that mean? Temple says it will continue to assist with the trash removal in some form until August 13th. In North Philadelphia, Jasmine Payne, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.